Children and teenagers have been impacted by bullying for generations. However, the impacts of bullying on mental health, which affect not just the victim, but also bystanders who watch it and the bullies themselves, have only lately come to light. According to the Center for Disease Control, bullying is a type of youth violence committed against a victim by a bully who displays unwelcome, aggressive behavior. Bullying comes from a power imbalance, whether real or perceived, in terms of social rank, wealth, physical prowess, or size. Bullying can injure a person physically, psychologically, socially, or academically if it occurs repeatedly over time. Bullying consists of threats, property destruction, forcing the victim to do something they don't want to do, physical intimidation or harm, tripping, hitting, pushing or spitting on a victim, social exclusion, making fun of the victim, mocking, name-calling or insults. Cyberbullies abuse their victims through texting, apps, forums and gaming platforms in public, in private or even anonymously. However, social media and texting enable cyberbullies to send victims pornographic photographs or share images of victims to others in addition to their regular weapons of rumors, threats, and name-calling. They may also ask their victims repeatedly, where are you? With whom are you? What do you have to say? Social media content is a permanent digital record that can be problematic for both bullies and victims unless it is reported and taken down. Parents and educators might not become aware of cyberbullying until the issue has progressed. Bullying is more common among kids and teens who are perceived as different due to their appearance, sexual orientation, cultural identity or disabilities. They might be freshmen or may have less friends. Bullies themselves could be well-liked and well-known or they might be strangers. They have experienced bullying in the past or might be bullying others right now. If kids have problems following rules, their parents are less active or they think violence is appropriate, they are more prone to bully others. During school years and into adulthood, bullying can have an impact on a person's mental, physical and emotional health. Physical harm, psychological distress and in very extreme circumstances, even death might result from it. Children and teenagers who have been bullied are more prone to suffer from depression, anxiety and occasionally long-term self-esteem issues. Victims frequently feel alone. Some victims may respond by using severe, unexpected violence. Bullies are more likely to engage in antisocial, sometimes violent actions, including picking fights and damaging property. They often experience academic difficulties, even to the point of dropping out. They have a higher likelihood of abusing drugs and alcohol. This can persist into adulthood when they are more likely to abuse their spouses, partners or kids or to commit crimes. Bullies and suicide don't necessarily go hand in hand and trauma comes in many different forms. However, bullying can increase the overwhelming sense of hopelessness and helplessness that causes suicide behavior. Bullying victims or bullies are more likely to act suicidally if the bullying is ongoing and frequent.
Bullet children may return home with unexplainable wounds, lost books or broken items. They can struggle to fall asleep and lose interest in past hobbies. They might skip lunch if they are too terrified to go to the cafeteria. Some people might avoid social situations while others might start to bully others. Victims may injure themselves or escape in an effort to cope. Bullying is traumatic for all parties involved. Therefore, it's critical to deal with it as soon as you can. To ensure safety and minimize bullying in the future, parents and teachers can collaborate. Techniques for reducing stress and relaxing can also be beneficial. Please always take care of the people around you and make them feel that they aren't alone. If you think this video helped you, please like and share with those who need it. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more videos. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time.